are you a senior Solidity developer or do you happen to know somebody that is a senior Solidity to developer? Well, if the answer is yes, guess what? SafeMoon is hiring. And if the answer is no, well, maybe you can find a little bit of joy in this video as I kind of run through just some of the detailed information of what the role entails that SafeMoon is looking to hire. Uh, the res roles, responsibilities, that kind of a thing. Before I do get any further into this, I want to say a special shout out. Thank you to our Patreon supporters. A double shout out. Thank you to Rem AG for being a higher tiered supporter. There is a link in the description. You can be up on that board for as little as a dollar a month. Also, please keep in mind, I'm not a financial advisor. Everything I'm sharing is my own opinion. It's my own research. I highly encourage you to do your own research. Taking a look over here on SafeMoon Warriors Twitter account. Very good Twitter account. If you guys want to get a lot of information pumps them out all the time. So I highly recommend Safe Moon Warrior over on Twitter. I'm at Crypto Atlas YT on Twitter if you want to check out my handle. So this is quoted as saying, we are looking for a senior Solidity developer to join our blockchain team as we build out exciting products within the Safe Moon ecosystem that will integrate with various smart contracts and Web3 technologies. It's the Safe Moon job offer on LinkedIn, provides the link. I will have a link to this in the description as well. And before I do go ahead and read through the LinkedIn, one thing I wanted to point out is somebody responded saying, don't see how this is a good thing. One would have hoped we already had a senior Solidity dev. And SafeMoon Spidey V2 says, um, I don't think a Solidity developer, Solidarity developer? I'm pretty sure you meant Solidity. <laughs> Solidity developer does what you think it does. This isn't a blockchain developer, but someone to build apps on the blockchain that has been built. Hope this helps. And the detailed information here says, Solidity developer is one who uses the object-oriented Solidity language to build and deploy smart contracts on Ethereum-based applications. Solidity is the native language of Ethereum, which gives enterprises a complete advantage of launching projects on the Ethereum blockchain platform. So this identifies more in regards to Ethereum. I don't know if you can do Solidity with um, Binance Smart Chain. By all means, if you guys are coders, let me know if that's technically possible. If it's not, and it's only for the Ethereum side, well, then this would be more pertaining to the PSafe moon. And we know that they created the bridge, but creating more practical applications for it, that definitely sounds like an exciting venture for sure. Okay, so that's one thing. Now, let's go ahead and go read through just a tad bit here. First off, this was posted five hours ago from the time of me putting this up. There are two applicants so far. This shows that it's a full-time associate position, 51 to 200 employees. We only know that there's over 100 people that work at SafeMoon right now. So if it's pushing closer to 200, I wouldn't be surprised. Uh, it shows one connection here. One connection is Ryan. And Wait, did Ryan add me? Hey, he did add me. Cool. It's through LinkedIn, but hey, it's progress. Okay. So SafeMoon is a leading innovative blockchain tech company serving 2.5 million wallet holders. Yada, yada. goes on a little bit about that. We're looking for a senior Solidity developer to join our blockchain team as we build out exciting products within the SafeMoon ecosystem that will integrate with various smart contracts and Web3 technologies. As a highly capable blockchain developer, your core responsibilities is to develop application features and interfaces using blockchain technology. You will also analyze the company's blockchain needs, designing customized smart contract technologies and maintaining our blockchain network. Your core responsibilities will include, in collaboration with the head of product, which would be Ryan, research, design, develop, and test block, uh, blockchain and Web3 technologies, develop application features and interfaces by using Solidity, Web3.js, Truffle, Ganache, or, I don't know how you say that, Remix, Node.js, and other blockchain Web3 programming languages, and writing effective and accurate multi-headed slash modular codes. Applying the latest encryption techniques to protect digital transaction data against cyber attacks and information hacks. <clears throat> Documenting blockchain development processes and complying with best practices in data protection. Consistently utilizing and maintaining assigned project management tickets in Jira or Jira that track issue completion. Maintaining the smart contract integrations that sync with client and server side applications while pushing and securing code to GitHub repositories by way of CI slash CD. Document new solutions via Confluence and other approved document repos, as well as maintaining existing ones. Optimize and secure blockchain applications by integrating new tools and technologies. 
keep up with current blockchain technologies and cryptography methods, and share this information with other blockchain developers within the SafeMoon team while acting as a consultative point of contact. Adhering to all the rules and regulations of data protection for digital payments, provide consultative research and elegant technical solutions for scalable software built out or build out, managing and producing the expected planned deliverables within the predefined deadline set forth by the global head of products and in alignment with the company roadmap. Consistent day-by-day -day communication and collaboration with the development team using Slack for all workday hours. Work in collaboration with the team and be a part of the planning of projects for long-term impact. It says, what do you need to be successful? There's just a little bit more here, by the way. A team player with consistent and effective communication skills. Previous experience working on smart contracts that integrate with ABIs is critical. Experience with Web3 related libraries and API documentation like Infura, BSC Scan, Etherscan.io, GitBlocked.io, etc. Strong debugging skills and or experience with attention to detail. Preference for working under an agile process methodology. Ability to work in a fast-paced startup environment with a global team within communication systems like Slack and Jira. Operational knowledge of JavaScript. You care about building high-quality, well-tested, and effective code. Ability to identify and solve for vulnerabilities within smart contract development and post-development. Proficiency with code repositories like GitHub and deployment. Best practices like CI slash CD. Excellent written communication skills, passion for molding the future of the Web 3.0 space. And then it says, SafeMoon is a leading innovative blockchain tech company serving 2.5 million wall holders. Just basically the same thing as what it said before. Okay. So yeah, uh, pay range is unavailable. Salary information is not available at the moment. And then you could say whether or not you're interested in finding out more information about the salary stuff, right? But you can go and apply for this. So I'll have a link in the description. Let me know what you guys think about the stuff that was said here. I'm not a coder. A lot of this is just over my head. Does this sound really interesting to you? Does it not sound that interesting to you? Does it make a lot of sense? Does it give you any kind of suspicions of things of what they're planning or why they need to fill this role? Does it have anything at all to do with Thomas and or what you think that has to do with Thomas? I, Looking at this, I think it has very, very little to do with Thomas, but that's just my opinion on it. Okay. So that's it. I got referral links in the description if you want to get free crypto or free stock. It is free money for you guys, not financial advice. And also, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit subscribe. Hit the thumbs up like button. It does help us out with the YouTube search algorithm. Click the bell icon so you know whenever we go live. And I will see you in the next episode.